Hello and welcome to a brand new video on the Basel United Superfans YouTube channel. Today, um, something a bit different. Um, as you may have seen by the thumbnail and title, you're probably a bit confused. So, uh, yeah, let's get into it. So, after a year and... So, a year and three months of doing the Basel United Superfans YouTube channel with Mia, my sister. Um, as you'd know as Mia, as I just said. Why am I rambling on? <laughs> um, yeah, um, basically, as you'd have known, for the past, like, year and three months, been doing YouTube with Mia, and... How do I put this? I mean, you've seen by the title anyway. She's going solo. She's decided that she's just going to abandon this channel. She's going to go and do her own thing, because she don't care about this channel anymore. She wants to succeed on her own. So basically, what's happened is, we had a bit of beef between us, even though we're brother and sister, had a bit of beef between us and we no longer want to work together. Um, the success, um, getting to 300 subscribers in the last year, uh, and, you know, she's decided that she wants to go off and <laughs> succeed on her own and gain some fame by herself because she's that type of person. She's selfish. So we had... A bit of a disagreement, we had beef between us, um, which I'm going to clear up now, so she's going solo. Of course, I'm only kidding, me and my sister do not have beef between us, we are brother and sister, we're family, we wouldn't have beef between us. Um, but yeah, so basically, she's, she's technically going solo, but she's technically not, at the same time. So she has created her own channel, BUFC Mia Wow, I'll send a picture up there, there'll be a link in the description, go check her out and subscribe. Um... Basically, you're going to be a bit confused because obviously she's still going to be involved with the Basel United Super fans. She's not going to just abandon this channel like that. She's not that type of person. As I say, we're brother and sister. We're family. We do not have beef between us. So, like, that was a joke. It was all a joke. Um, but yeah, so she has decided to create her own channel where she will be doing opinions. Of, oh my god, what just happened to my voice? Opinions. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, it always happens to me on camera. So yeah, she'll be doing opinions on games, um, doing interviews, and she'll, I think she'll occasionally do her own match day vlog, like her own perspective of the games, which will be very, very good um, for her to do her own thing. Um, of course, I have had a lot of people say to me, when you first started the channel, Tommy, it seemed to be all about you. Um, Mia didn't get herself involved in that, like, in it that much. That's because back then she was quite camera shy. It was all new to her. She hadn't been involved in a YouTube channel before. So she was quite camera shy. Me, I'm quite a confident person and I don't really care what other people think. Like, like I think like the main thing she used to say to me was, oh, people think I'm a bit weird, you know, if I'm vlogging in the street, just talking to a phone, like going, oh yeah, hello, welcome to a brand new vlog. Um, me, on the other hand, like, I don't care, people can judge me, I'm not going to care, it's what I enjoy doing, so, you know, if your opinion is, oh, well, you're a mug, you, you, you're vlogging, that's your opinion, <laughs> I don't really care, um, but, gone off topic now, back on track, um, so Mia back then used to be quite camera shy, however, in the last few, I'd say about six months maybe, she has got herself more involved with the channel, which is absolutely excellent, because of course, it wouldn't be called the Basel United Super Fan without, uh, I had to emphasise the sir there, because a lot of people say the Basel United Superfan Tommy, well it's not, it's the Basel United Superfans. Um, I'm not criticising anyone who makes this mistake, because it is an easy mistake to make, because obviously, like I say, she never used to get involved with the channel that much, because she was camera shy. However, she has recently got more involved in the channel, which is very, very good to see. Um, so that makes me very happy to see, because... She's my sister, after all. I've encouraged her for a long time as well, to uh, like saying to her, you know, do this bit of the vlog, do that, get more involved, you know, do match interviews and stuff like that. She still is a little bit shy. However, she is getting more involved, which is the very, very good thing. So, to grow her confidence levels even more, she's decided that she's going to create her own YouTube channel, occasionally do her own match day vlogs, do interviews, opinions on matches, which I think is going to be very, very good for her. Um, I'm not going to be creating my own separate channel because, um, at the end of the day, I'm happy with what I'm doing here, doing it with my sister. Um, 
but you know, I'm not going to judge her for going off and creating her own channel because, as I say, she's still going to be involved with this channel 100%. Um, but, you know, she just wants to have a bit of independence as well, which, you know, I completely, I completely support her in that as well. Um, but yeah, it's really good to see that she wants to do it because it will help her grow her confidence levels. She'll probably get more involved with this channel a lot more. Of course, um, her, I don't know if her main priority is going to be her channel. I can imagine it probably will be because, of course, it's BUFC, me and Well, I'm not going to be as involved in that channel as much unless she gets me in it. Um, her first video we've started creating, um, like introducing to the channel, she's going to have me in that as well, um, purely because she wants me to. Um, and I'm sure sometimes I'll be her, her guest as well because, of course, we go to the games together, um, which will be very, very good. Now, me and Mia, we've had a great journey so far on this channel. Um, you know, 300 subscribers in just over a year, which is absolutely, absolutely amazing. Um, yeah, it, it has been a great journey with Mia so far. Um, when we first started this channel, this channel, we didn't expect it to be that much of a big thing. We expected it to be, you know, a couple, like maybe 50 subscribers, 60, maybe. But when we hit 100, we thought, you know, it's going all right. It might still not be a big thing. Hit 200, and literally a week later, we hit 300. So that tells us that it's becoming a big thing. Um, obviously, some football vloggers they, out there, they have 1,000, 100,000, 80,000, 50,000. You know, there's so many YouTube vloggers um, for football that are so much bigger than this channel, so much bigger than me and Mia. So it isn't that big, for, but for two people our age, it is a massive achievement and to be honest what we've achieved in just over a year has been absolutely amazing we've achieved over 16,000 views or like 15,000 views um, we've got over 300 subscribers um, and our most viewed video has like a thousand views which was the West Ham Burnley video um, and yeah so and we've collaborated with people like Smith um, James Beardwell Ellis Platten um, all three YouTube vloggers, um, Smith, he's a ground hopper, he does his On The Road series, Ellis Platten, he does Away Days, and James Beardwell, he's a Whitton Town FC and DTFC super fan. Um, but yeah, um, check out all three of their channels as well. Um, I'll probably put a link in the description, there'll be a picture on screen probably as well. Um, but yeah, it really has been a great journey with Mia so far. Um, and I did set a target. We did set a target not long ago saying 200 subscribers before the end of 2019. Did you do it? You absolutely smashed it. You hit 300 in, before the end of 2019. Like two months early. And it's just amazing to see what we've achieved. It's like, and if I'm honest, it is all thanks to Smith. If it wasn't for Smith, we wouldn't have hit 200, uh, 200. We wouldn't have hit 300 because obviously he done his on the road to Basel United. Put a link in the description and you know, so many people came to our channel. Honestly, the comments, reading the comments on the videos, because we do do that. Um, yeah, reading the comments, it was like, yeah, Smith sent me here. Here from Smith, love your channel, whatever. And I was just like, wow, the Smith army really is taking over. Um, but yeah, his, his shout out really meant a lot to us, honestly. And your support is absolutely amazing. So thank you to every single one of you who have helped us to reach 300 subscribers. Now, of course, I did say... For 200 subscribers before the end of 2019, we would do a giveaway. And we hit 200 subscribers in... Uh, so we went from 160 to 260 in under 24 hours. So we gained over 100 subscribers in under 24 hours. So we already reached that. And then literally five days later, we've now reached 300 subscribers. So that's absolutely amazing. I did promise a giveaway. And I'm not lying to you. Uh, I have got a giveaway. It's not that big because obviously it's the first giveaway. I'm sure we will do more. Um, but just to first start off with a giveaway. A Basel United shirt from last season. Um, yeah, I'm going to get it signed from the whole first team. I do promise. I keep promising this. Um, but I will get it signed from the whole first team. It's from last season. Um, yeah, uh, it's got the Bostic uh, League logo on it. Obviously, it's not sponsored by Bostic anymore. Um, but still, uh, Basel United shirt. Here's proof going to get it signed and everything get it signed from the first team and i will do a giveaway um <clears throat> yeah so hopefully get that done soon and get it given away as soon as possible um which will be very good um yeah not really much else to say other than like thank you so much for your amazing support um mine and mia's journey so far together has been absolutely amazing 
And of course, as I say, go check out her separate channel, um, Baz United, uh, but, uh, like BUFC, me a whale. Links in the description. Uh, go check out our channel. It would be greatly appreciated. Show her as much support as you possibly can. Show her as much support as you give on this channel. Because honestly, um, the support on this channel has been absolutely amazing over the last year or, and a bit. Um, so I have every confidence that Mia can do the same. Mia can achieve great things on her channel as well. Honestly, she may seem camera shy at first, but honestly, she is a great she is a great speaker. When it, when when she gets when she when she gets the hang of things, she is a great speaker. Because obviously, as I say, at the start of this channel, she was camera shy. She started to get into it a bit more, and now she's not nervous at all. However, on the, on this channel, if I ask her like, "Oh, what's your opinions on the game?" she'll say something like, "Just oh yeah, it was good." But that's because I mean, I put her on the spot a lot of the time. I'm like, "Oh yeah, what's your opinions? What's what's your score prediction? Opinions at half time?" You know, I put her on the spot, and she she needs to have time to think. But yeah. Give it some time, I'm sure she will grow really well as much as this channel has. So please do me a favour, go into the link in the description and subscribe to her channel. She will greatly, greatly appreciate the support. Um, yeah, it's really good to see that she's going to do something independently on YouTube. So make sure you go check it out. Um, she will really, really appreciate the support, honestly. So thank you very much uh, for watching. Thank you very much for 300 subscribers. Um, as I said, um, doing the giveaway, I will explain um, once... Um, I've got the shirt signed and everything. I will explain how you can win the giveaway and what you need to do. Um, and then the lucky winner of the giveaway will um, receive that shirt signed by the whole first team. Um, not much else to say other than thank you for your amazing support. Please keep it up. If we get it, 50, subs uh, 50 subscribers? Oh, God. So I've noticed in recent videos... Um, we've hit around 50, the 50 mark of likes on videos. So I'm going to go 50 likes on this video, please. That would be greatly appreciated. Thank you very much for all your support. Please like, please subscribe, turn post notifications on so you never miss a matchday vlog. Um, and the matchday vlog from today that I filmed, um, away at Holbridge Sports when we drew one all. I just gave away the score. What an idiot. Um, yeah, that will be uploaded soon. Make sure you turn post notifications on so you don't miss that video. Um, as I said, go subscribe to me channel. Thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next vlog.